Hey guys and welcome back to another squad builder challenge on FIFA 17. This time as you can see we're doing it on Burnley, Stephen DeFore. I think he brought the FA Cup man the match one I think. I think about, what, about two maybe even more than that months ago. So he actually looks like a decent player, 70 pace, 78 shooter and 83 passing, 82 dribbling and 80 physical. Not too bad stats to be honest. So if you are new around here guys I'll quickly go through the rules just in case you forgot. I've got into the store, open one premium goal pack, just take one player from there and use that into the squad. Then I gotta do three different nations, three different leagues, and I can only have three players from the same team. So let's get into the pack and let's see what player we can get. So it says one premium goal pack, just open this. We pick one player from the player that pops up. Hopefully it's gonna be someone half decent. It's a rare at least. CM from Napoli, Giorgino. Okay. Not actually a bad player to be honest. Do we get anyone else? We get this guy, where's he from? We get Santander, not too bad. And we get an Australian guy from the Sydney FC, so again, not that bad. I've got a lone player. Okay, so obviously I'm gonna go with Jorginho, because not a bad league and not a bad nation to be honest, so. And he'll fit any formation as well, so that's pretty good to be honest, so let's just stick him in there for now. So we'll just have a quick look, see what this lone player is. I'm not going to use this guy, but might as well just open it up and have a quick look. Alaba. Don't use lone players, so don't really, no real point actually keeping him. So quick start off him. And yeah, let's go into the squad, active squad, and let's start making this team. So let's start randomizing the formation. And like I said in all my videos, you have to trust I'm not looking at the screen, so I actually do get a random formation. So. Let's start scrolling. So we'll stop in three, two, one. Four, one, two, one, two. Okay, never play this formation. Looks like it's gonna be a lot of links going everywhere from every player. So this might be a tricky one. So might not actually be a bad thing to actually do. Let's just change Georgina card to start with. We're going to a CDM. You can see where he is and then Right then, where am I going to start with this one? This is not an easy one to do, because like I said, there's links going everywhere. There's at least three links going off every player. So, um, let's go with Lukaku. Nice, easy one to start with. Nice, perfect link there. You know what? I'll leave the straight position just for now, because I don't really know where I'm going to go with that one. So, let's go and look through these. Let's see if I got any from the Syria, because I have sold a lot of Syria ones, to be honest, because they actually sell for quite a lot of money. A few weeks ago, so could do a boner. Put a boner in there for now. Might not be a bad one to have. So right midfielders we've got. Let's put Delafeo in. I've never used Delafeo. I've used Bellman quite a lot, so I don't want to use Bellman. So let's go for Demarcos. Never use Demarcos, so let's give this Demarcos a try. We're gonna have to do see if there is. Yes, there is. I know there is. With the Castillo A, the Spanish, only Albiol, so Albiol can come in there. So in there comes, and then what I could do here, nice easy one, I know what I'm going to go for here if I've actually got him. I'm not sure if I've got him, I have a quick look, I doubt I have, no I haven't. The concept, Adrian, nice easy link there. So let's have a quick look for him on the transfer market. So I've got my three leagues in here, I've got three different nations in here, so I basically just try it and Finish the squad off the best I can, to be honest. Yeah, let's look at Mertens and see what he's going for. 25. Oh, let's take this one. 18 and a half. Nice. So Mertens in there. Nice little link to obviously Georgino and DeFour. So I'm going to just have a quick look to see who I've got in my club, to be honest with you. So I've not got a lot of players, to be honest. Let's go with Clichy. I don't think I've actually used Clichy before. So this one is just go for either Belgium or a Premiership player or a Serie A player to be honest. This one should be quite easy so let's just have a quick look, see who I've got. Could go Bashway maybe. Yeah, not really anyone that much better. So yeah, let's go for Bashway then. Bashway just comes in and finishes that team. So it's not a bad looking team to be honest. Maybe one or two more Belgians that I would have liked to have, but actually not that bad of a team. So I'll quickly run through your team for you guys. So Adrian and goals, the Marcus on right back, 
Albiol, Ogbonna, Clichy make up the rest of the defence. Then we've got Giorgino in for the CDM, Delafeu, obviously man of the match, Defoe, Mertens, Bashuayi and then Lukaku up front. Not a bad looking squad to be honest, 82 rated, 100 chem, pretty good players. So what I'm going to do guys, just going to do the bench real quick and then we'll get into a game and we'll see how we do in this game. So as soon as I've done the bench guys, I'll talk to you and we'll see what our opponent looks like and we'll see how we do in this. So guys, we got our opponent for today's episode and he is playing with a guest as well. So you've got the man of match, uh, Mane, Inform, Andre Gray, Martial, Cazorla, Coutinho, Kante, Bailly, Koscielny, Walker, Larice. And Mashuak, I think, a left back, I think it is, from West Ham. Yeah, they're actually a very good team, to be honest. Very pacey up front, so that is going to have to be something I have to look out for. But, like I said, he's playing with a guess, so hopefully that hinders him a little bit. Nice ball early on to get. Who is it? Is it Lukaku? No, Bashuai. And Bashuai just chips it over to make it 1 0 straight away. What a start for us. This never happens, we never get a good start like this. We normally waste loads of chances before we get a goal, but yeah, nice ball. Nice ball there into Batshuayi, just took the time, and nice little chip over top, and great finish. One nil up after two minutes, exactly what I wanted. Switch it over, nice little ball over to Dev Bale, switches it. So get that in, nice ball again. To Lukaku, strike that Lukaku to make it 2-0. Two chances and two goals. Going pretty well so far. They have had a couple of chances, but they're long shots, so probably won't show it then, but they have had a couple of shots, but like I said, nothing really troubling, but great ball to get Lukaku through. Lukaku go one-on-one -on -one with the goalkeeper and start in to make it 2-0. Alright, so they go back to 2-1. Like I said they're not actually like that bad of players to be honest, they're playing pretty well, but to be honest, I should be winning this. So, yeah, they pull it back to 2 1. Good little finish by Gazzola, to be honest. But, yeah, we'll carry on doing this. We'll see how it's going to go. And, by the looks of it, there's going to be quite a few goals in this game. Play that in to Merton. Make the skill pass. Come back to Lukaku. Strike that Lukaku. Eyes at the post. And the four. So, get out to Merton. A little bit too far. Mertens though, pull it back, 2-4 to four, and he got a blocking corner kick, alright, I'm actually enjoying this game, nice play, see so if I can get that back, see so if I get that back to the four. the four with the ball, the four shoots and obviously Lloris saved it the first time, but got the rebound and before gets his goal, he's actually been playing pretty well for me to be honest so far, so good for him to get a goal and obviously the squad builder is actually based around him, so nice play there, to the four, come back in, shoot at Loris, but then it falls kindly to him. And we go 3 1 up going into half time. So, anyway, that is half time, like I said, and we are 3 1 up. It's been a pretty good game, to be honest. I'm enjoying it. A lot of goals, a lot of action coming in. So, yeah, like I said, 3 1 up, 8 shots, 5 on target, 54% possession for me. He's had 5 shots, well, they've had 5 shots, 3 on target. Like I said, there is 2 1 play, and so. Yeah, it's an exciting game to be honest, I'm enjoying this. So yeah, let's get into the second half, hopefully we can carry on, get another goal or two. And yeah, we'll win this game. Good play by Lukaku to slide it into Delafeo. Wasn't a good touch though. Nice little turn. See if Lukaku will get in the box, see if get it into the four though. So Gino picked it off, have a strike to Gino, and it's a good save by Lloris. Play by Mertens. Put it back to Batshuayi. They pull that through to Lukaku on side. Who strikes it? Oh, he's hit the bar. Oh, what a strike. It's the four on the ball. Cut it back. Nice play. Then spread that out wide. Great ball to get Demarcus in. The triple trap that. To Lukaku. I don't know why he's not shooting. Go for Giorgino though. Have a shot, Giorgino. And what a finish by Giorgino. Holy shit. That wasn't, well, it went better than I thought. I just thought it was a hit down to see where it goes, but what a strike for Gino. 
comes up to him and gets one touch on the ball there, and smashes that and it goes to the top left hand corner. What a strike. What a finish. And that is game. And we do win that 4 0, guys. Then we'll watch this little clip. Back to where he started all off for us. Very nice goal to start with. So, like I said, that is it. We win that 4 1. And everyone played really well, to be honest. Adrian had a low rating because he had nothing to do, to be honest, apart from three or two or three saves, really. He didn't have much to do. Mertens didn't play that well either. It's because he was in our left midfield instead of left wing position, so not really his best position playing that way. But apart from that, obviously the squad builder was around the four, and obviously Giorgino came in as well as our second player, and they both played really well, to be honest. They looked absolutely really good players. And as you can see, Delafeo was our man of the match, who have, again played really well. And obviously, Batshuayi and Lukaku in the front, two powerful players, two pasty players, and two good finishers, to be honest. So, you know what? It went really well, I'm happy with that. So, the question probably is after the player review, or the squad builder challenge around him, is the four really worth the money? Now, I did buy him, like I said, probably like two months ago, so the price might be completely different to what I bought him for. So, depending on what the price is, he's probably better in that midfield position instead of the cam position, but. I think he's a pretty good player, not a bad player at all. I will have a quick look, just to have a look and see how much he is for you guys, just in case you are wondering how much he is, so I'll have a quick look for you now before I end the episode. So I'm going to have a quick scan of how much he's going for. Cheapest I've found so far is about 20k, so for about 20k I think he's not actually that bad of a player. Like I said, because of oh, oh, 18k, okay, so he's going for about 18k then. Yeah, 18k, I definitely buy him for 18k. Actually, a pretty good player, and obviously in a Premiership. And obviously, because he is Belgium, you get a lot of easy links around him, so it's a very good player to actually get. So, yeah, you'll probably get from about 16, 17, 18, probably max. So, yeah, definitely, I would definitely go and get him. So, you can see 17, 7, 50, so yeah, he's a very good player to actually get, so. If you are looking for someone like that, then he'd be a good player for you. So guys, that is going to be it for today's episode though. I will be back next time. Either I will do Andre Gray or a Michael Keane one. I'm going to do both of them coming up. So I'll, I'll either do one Andre Gray and one Michael Keane one, or I'll do a combined together them both. Maybe into one episode. But that'll be for different ones anyway, but like I said, I will be doing a Falcao, Echo, Torres. I will be doing some of them players as well. So look out for them as they're coming up, and obviously look out for my pattern play series that I'm also doing on FIFA 17. But like I said, this is going to be it for today's episode though. So if you did enjoy it, then hit that like button. If you are new on here, hit the subscribe button. You much appreciate. And I'll catch you all in the next squad builder. See ya.